welcome back. It is time to check in with the Columbus Metropolitan Library. So Ben's with us today. Um, we've been talking about all these different locations and the things that are going on. And the big news for you is that the Hilltop is opening. That's right, Patty. Many of your viewers uh, might recall uh, that we opened our new Carl Road branch earlier this month. Big news now for your viewers in the west side, um, particularly in the Hilltop community, we're gonna be opening our new Hilltop branch this Thursday, September 30th. Uh, we're really keeping a close eye on Liz's forecast because we're mm -hmm. fingers crossed for, yeah. for good weather for this outdoor ribbon cutting ceremony. Uh, but we hope you'll join us uh, 511 South Hague Avenue at our Hilltop Branch, 3.30 p.m. on Thursday. We'll have a brief ceremony. We'll cut the ribbon, and we'll welcome you inside this new 21st century library. Now, I say new. Technically, we're calling it a renovation. I can assure you, when you step inside, this is a new library. It will blow you away. Everything is new. Nothing will be familiar. Uh, we have added about uh, 12,000 square feet of space to this building. Um, and opened it up to so much natural sunlight and beauty, and it is just going to blow you away. Can't wait to show it off. And so what are some of the new things that are inside that people aren't used to, or maybe even some old programs that they didn't know that they had? Sure. You know, I mean, just the, the, the idea of what a library is, I think, is going to – it's changed so much. And, and so people are going to be really surprised when they come in, and there's meeting rooms and – there's uh, so much seating space. We have a dedicated teen area. We have a tween area now in the children's <laughs> space. Um, we have a classroom in the children's area where we can have ready for kindergarten classes to help preschoolers and their families get ready for kindergarten and academic success beyond kindergarten. Um, we have a job help center where adult customers can get help with interviewing skills, resume writing, cover letter writing, um, help filing unemployment claims and any other uh, employment needs that they might have. Um, you know, there's, uh, we'll of course have our public PCs for our computer lovers. We will have, um, you know, our, our school help center, which is always very popular in the after school hours, is even bigger. So we know that we're going to be seeing some students here this school year. Um, but just the look and the feel of this, of this new library is really going to knock your socks off. So it looks like it's going to be a great time going to be here, you know, before we know it, <laughs> the countdown is on. I do want to ask you, because I've just seen so many people online talking about the COVID test that they can pick up at libraries sure. and uh, you guys have run out of them and then you've gotten them back. And it just seems like a, they're really in high demand right now. One, will the Hilltop have those two? And then two, what is really the best way if, if the library is the route that you really want to go to get that test to bring it to your house? Um, what should you do? Should you be calling in advance because of how quickly they've been going? Absolutely. And great question. Um, you know, we've been offering these COVID testing kits uh, for at home use uh, since this spring. Um, earlier this summer, we were handing out between 100 and 200 per week. Just the last couple of weeks, we've been giving out thousands. I think just last week we gave away 7,000 or close to it. Um, so demand is incredibly high for these test kits right now. Um, we are ordering them as fast as we can. And they are, you know, we are handing them out even quicker. So um, our message is just please be patient with us. Uh, and if um, you want to, if you're looking for a testing kit, we advise you to give us a call, 614-645-2275. Um, our staff are inundated with these calls right now. So again, please be patient. Um, and if we do have them in stock, please use the curbside pickup uh, call uh, to order them uh, from our staff. They can run them out to you. Please do not come inside to pick up these tests, particularly if you are symptomatic yeah. or are COVID positive or tested positive recently or was around somebody who tested positive recently. So we're trying to do this in a safe and efficient way. But right now, the demand is just outweighing the supply. So we're doing the very best we can. And I do want to ask, just because I've also seen people talking and questioning this, how many should people be taking out at a time? Because I know in some cases, they do want to take more than one. That's right. You know, um, we would just say only take as many as you need. I mean, okay. you know, we're, we're giving them away for free. Um, you know, take as many as, as you need for your family. Um, and, and please no more because yeah. you know, we're trying to accommodate a large demand right now. Um, and we're, we're flying through these pretty quickly. 
That's pretty uh, remarkable that you said last week was 7,000 COVID, ca- uh, COVID right. tests at least. Yeah. Um, okay. So they will give you a call and then just, you know, exciting news for, for our health top viewers. They get to go and see the library again. Thank you so much, Ben.